You know, flying ants are always a problem. And over here at ABC Pest Control, we have to identify ants on a regular basis. And flying ants are something that people see that they always need identified. Well, once you see an ant or once you see something that's flying and you want to get it identified, the very first thing to find out whether it's an ant or not is to determine whether or not it has three individual body segments, the head, the thorax, and the abdomen. If it does have those three segments, you can definitely say that, okay, it is an ant and it's not a ferret fly or one of the filth flies that we might have or even uh, maybe one of the biting flies that we see outside. If you do have those three segments, the next thing to determine is to find out what type of a flying ant is it. Is it something that I might uh, be worried about being inside my home, like possibly termites? Well, ants, flying ants, have two pairs of wings, but those two pairs have one pair longer, one pair shorter. If it's a termite, a termite only has two wings, and it, the, the two wings are exactly the same size. So that should at least help you identify the difference between a, a, either a fly, a termite, and an ant. And remember, the best way is always take that sample maybe down to your local pest control operator and have them take a look at it, and I'm sure they can help you out. Remember, I'm Mark Govan here with ABC Pest Control in Largo, Florida, hoping you have a pest-free day.